In the last 25 years, the speed of progress has accelerated so much that it's very difficult these days to keep up with it. Um, it seems somehow as though it might be impossible to detoxify childhood, to find the, the right circumstances in a 21st century world to make sure that kids are okay. And um, I fear that people quite often grow despondent. Indeed, shortly after writing Toxic Childhood, I was a bit depressed about it. It was only when I realised that instead of concentrating on the world outside, we should concentrate on the children and on what children need for healthy development. And in fact, that hasn't changed and it's not likely to because biological evolution is a very long, slow process. So children are still born much the same as they've ever born and they still need the same basic experiences in early life. And I've managed now to get it down to the fingers of one hand. It's not difficult. Given in a modern healthy society we are feeding our children on nourishing food, making sure they're getting enough sleep and enough exercise, basically all they require to grow up whole, healthy, bright and balanced are these five things. The first one goes almost without saying, that's love. All children need that because all human beings need it. But it's got to be balanced in a social animal with something else. That's discipline. If you're going to live with other people, you've got to know how to behave, to know the ropes, to be um, able to accept boundaries and abide by them. So grown-ups, the responsible people in children's lives, particularly parents, have got to balance warmth and firmness. And that's very difficult in a consumerist society which is telling us love is the same as indulgence. And instead of giving your children boundaries, you should just protect them within an inch of their lives. Love and discipline, not indulgence and overprotection. And indeed, the middle finger, the one that um, makes children free to grow up whole, um, that one is something which we can't give them, not personally, they've got to take it for themselves. That's play, the sort of usually outdoor, loosely supervised play that children have enjoyed throughout the millennia since time immemorial, but that's getting more and more difficult to provide in a world where we're told to be frightened all the time. Um, the thumb, I've given that one to the thumb because uh, it was our opposable thumbs along with sort of standing up on our hind legs that gave us control over our world. We began to use tools and human beings got the ultimate tool, the one that the other animals didn't get. That's language. And it's very close to love. It comes from the communication between parent and child right from the moment they're born and the opportunities for kids to talk not communicate electronically, but really talk and learn all the communication skills, um, body language, facial expression, tone of voice, which come from a whole childhood full of real life interaction with real life human beings. And then the final one, well I've given that to the pinky, it's the least important really of all four, that's education. In fact, it's next to discipline, because it's beginning to discipline your brain. But I'm afraid that education is not going to happen unless we've got the first four. And those four are not something you learn in school. They're called, not taught, from children's real life interactions with the real world and real people. They are the result of a four letter word, care, and care is in many ways much more important than education because it's the basis upon which education can be built. I fear that in 21st century Britain we no longer value care, we don't see it as important. I think the other message about the five fingers, the five important quality things that children need, is that um, they're all free and perhaps that's why we've not heard much about them of recent years. In a competitive consumer society, nobody tells you about the free stuff, but that's what they need. So I suppose this is a recession-beating formula.